I'm Beth with the University of Florida's Scambia County Extension. And one of the weeds that we can often see on the side of the road or growing in fields that's really gained a lot of popularity and attention in recent years is a plant called frog fruit or Phyllonotiflora. This is a nice ground cover that grows kind of close to the ground and it will form these nice long running stems that can root at the node. But the really nice little thing about this plant is it will form little flower stalks with a delicate little verbena-like flower up top. Now I first learned this plant called matchhead because that's kind of what these flower stalks look like, little matchsticks. Uh, but it is a really nice ground cover for us and the reason people are more interested in this plant right now is because they're looking for a companion plant for some large lawn areas like we have here at the Escambia Extension Office. This plant kind of can just blend into existing grass and offer you some pollinators services if you have zoysia or St. Augustine or even enhance those pollinator services of centipede grass. Now this plant the good thing is it will grow in some drier conditions and it also tolerates moisture. Now if we go through a pretty long drought it may kind of dry back a little bit um, but that's okay if water is supplied it will do well. Now up here in North Florida, there is potential if we go through a hard freeze to have some damage on it, but it will return. And then when we cool off, the leaves kind of turn purple. But what we really love about this little ground cover frog fruit is that pollinators will visit the flowers and it's also host to a couple of butterflies, including the buckeye. So if you're thinking about kind of enhancing your lawn a little bit, doing something a little bit different than that traditional monoculture of turf, you may want to consider frog fruit as a, as a companion for some of those lawn areas. For more information about anything related to gardening, please contact us here at the University of Florida Escambia County Extension.